And then Ronaldo! Oh! What a goal by Cristiano Ronaldo! What's the crack, lads? Welcome back to the channel. And a lot of people have been asking me about Cristiano Ronaldo, right? As we know with the V3.0, we are going to be getting Ronaldo carried over. And is this guy worth it, right? So if you are spinning for this player, you can actually clear the box and get Ronaldo in the 11 spins if you want to go down that route. There has been multiple versions of Ronaldo, right? We'll get to that. But for this guy, he's a goal poacher. He's got some very decent stats. And of course, we also have um, a lot of player levels to go for as well. Standard form is a bit of a misstep on this card. I think for one of Ronaldo's last cards, especially that he's still playing for Portugal and still banging him in, I definitely think he should have had unwavering form. Player skills, you do need to put on a few player skills. We'll add those to the video as well. I would definitely recommend super sub for this card as an impact player. And I would also definitely recommend and um, I would, yeah, I would definitely recommend double touch on this card or else one touch pass, depending on the build that you're going to do. So we're going to have two builds here. But look, he's a really good player, lads. He's not going to be run and gun like Romario or Mbappe, but he definitely isn't as clunky as somebody like, say, Drogba or Adriano. Um, if you're used to playing with those where it's power and pace, you can be, you know, beasting with him, right? So the first build that we're going to take a look at is this pure target man build, right? You can see the stats there pop in. Don't worry, we will go back to that in a second. And this version of Ronaldo is all about scoring and linking up play as a target man. So it's balls into him high, um, getting on flicks, getting on, you know, little movements. You do need to probably put one touch pass on him. That's a key for this card because you're going to be knocking on a lot of balls. But for this card here, we've got 10 into shooting, 12 into dexterity, 5 into aerial strength and 2 into goalkeeper 1. That's going to give us an absolute beast up front. We're going to have 95 overall for offensive awareness, 88 finishing. That's going to get a boost to 90 with the player form arrow as an impact sub or else starting if he's on top form acceleration is 82 and 94 jump huge i mean dribbling skills you've got scissors faint and chop turn i would definitely recommend um you know put on to this build i would put on maybe shooting skills and super sub i wouldn't really worry too much about one touch pass unless you have it that you can throw on him and super sub would be a good one as well double touch not so much with this card because you're going to be just getting rid of the ball as soon as you get it you know the next build that we have is more of a dribble centric uh, Cristiano Ronaldo so that's kind of the double touch one that we're going to be taking a look at right but for this version you're literally going to be using him as your target man to lump the ball up you're going to be finishing and knocking on headers you're going to be finishing and knocking on balls in from crosses and aerial um you know acrobatic finishing that you have there I like this card it's a bit slower obviously we've gone massive with the dexterity but that's more so for the offensive awareness to get that up to 95. So the second version of Ronaldo that we have here from this clip is going to be all about like his first touch, his dribbling, his tight possession, doing a few tricks, his brilliant ball control as you see here, absolutely insane stats. Yes, he is still going to be a little bit slow. He's not going to be as agile as Romario and as, you know, those type of players like Mbappe, Son, Salah, any of those, but he's not as clunky as I said as Drogba or one of those bigger guys that are like over 185 cm, right? So again, we've gone 10 with dribbling here to really change this up that's going to give our boost to ball control and tight possession we're going to be at the 90 zone with ball control that's going to make a massive difference listen lads i will say right having played with ronaldo quite a lot on my other account okay if you are looking for a ronaldo build right even though this one isn't on on the surface it doesn't look like it's going to be a beast right if you are struggling with any build of cristiano ronaldo make this exact build right and also try and throw on one touch pass on him and you will see a card that will just do absolute wonders for you, scoring late goals. Um, he's just one of the best players in the game if you use him right, okay? Like, jump is there, heading is there. He's also got the player skill heading. Now, a lot of people talk about this player of the week, Ronaldo. But if you actually look at this player of the week, Ronaldo, he is probably worse in stats and everything else, right, than this build that we have here, apart from the fact that he has one-touch pass. You can see there that he's got one-touch pass. Um, so if you throw one-touch pass on this version of the card, you're going to get a far superior version of him right the reason why i also like this cristiano ronaldo over the player of the week that we're seeing here is because of that acceleration that you can just get it a little bit more and also you don't need to have that ball control and tight possession as low as the other cards right so i definitely recommend this card if you're looking for somebody and as i said if you are struggling and you're just looking for a one one kind of stop shop and a one fits all player guide right build and you haven't really used Ronaldo before or you used him before and he hasn't worked for you 
just try this one and get back to me and let me know. I guarantee you, you will see results. So yeah, that is it for me, lads. Let me know what you guys think of this video. Let me know of this new standard and this new format. I will be back quite soon. It's a short and sweet video. I give Ronaldo a thumbs up. If you already have a card of him, you don't need to go massively, you know, in on him. Um, you can, you kind of retrain different players, but this 26 level Ronaldo is a beast when you throw one touch pass on him. So that is it for me, lads. I will be back in a bit. Peace. Don't forget to subscribe.